Hello everyone, I am B. Ganga Devi, Assistant Professor of Commerce CA, School of Commerce, Kaiser College of Arts and Science for Women. Now we are going to see Management Information System for BBA Unit 1. Introduction MIS provides information for a managed activities in an organization. So it is basically concerned with processing data into information and it is then communicated to the various department in an organization for appropriate decision making. The MIS defined as a system based on the database of the evolved for the purpose of providing information to the people in the organization. So it is defined as an integrated system of man and machine for providing the information to support the operations, the management and the decision making function in the organization. Some of the characteristics of MIS. It provides reports with fixed and standard formats that is hard copy and soft copy reports. It uses internal data stored in the computer system. In end users can develop custom reports. It requires formal request from users. Some components of MIS. First, marketing research system. Marketing research can be seen as a systematic and objective search for and analysis of data and information relevant to the identification and solution of any problem in the field of marketing. Second, marketing intelligence system that is MIS, the process of acquiring and analyzing information in order to understand the market, both existing and potential customers. Next, internal record system. Marketing managers really on internal report on orders, sales, price, cost, inventory level, receivables, payables and so on. Decision support system. BSSS is a computer-based information system that supports business or organizational decision-making activities. Next, various types of MIOs. Transaction Processing System, Decision Support System, Executive Information System, Marketing Information System, Office Automation System, School Management Information System. The aim of Management Information System is to inform management and help them make informed decision about management and the way the business is run. Benefits of MIS It improves personal efficiency. It facilitates interpersonal communication. It promotes learning or training. It increases organizational control. It generates new evidence in support of a decision. It creates a competitive advantage over co competition. It helps automate the managerial processes. Conclusion So, MIS differ from a regular information system because the primary objective of these systems are to analyze other system dealing with the operational activities in the organization. So, the or in organization growth, MIS allow information to move between functional area and department instantly. So reducing the need for face-to-face -face communication among employees. So thus increasing the responsiveness of the organization. Thank you.